Hello, Alex from Trainer Day here. Let me show you today how to use a Coach Jack plan in Zwift. So here you, I am, you can see my calendar is empty. I'll go up to Coach Jack Beta. I will create a new plan. I'm gonna, well, I can use Strava. Ask me my name. No, I don't have a specific goal. Let's do a 12 week plan. I'd like to do climbing. No injuries, great, okay, take me to my plan. So now Jack has created you a plan that he recommends. Uh, let's just say that he looked at the days that you train in Strava, but you know, my days are kind of random. So uh, let's change these days to a better plan, a more typical plan, let's just say, for, for a, or even the Sunday. Okay, Tuesday, Wednesday, Saturday, Sunday, and let's do our long rides on Saturdays. Okay. And then you can see here, I've got a ramp rate, which means how much does it increase over time? You can flatten that down or increase it. Um, you can see my start hours is 11, but I will go ahead and change that to like six. And here's a plan for me. So now I've got my plan, I like it. I could change it to a different type of plan or I can even create a custom plan. And a custom plan just lets the, you pick the workout sequences each week that you like. So maybe I want, I like threshold blocks or I like something else. But I'll go ahead and stick with the serious Italian. And I'll say, okay, that's a great plan. If I want, for example, to customize my daily limits, I can s select that and change it so I only train 45 minutes on Tuesdays or whatever I want. And then I click Save and Next. And then it says, go ahead and send it to my calendar. You also have Send It to My Plans. You can read the descriptions as to why the one. I'm gonna send it to this Monday rather than next Monday. I'm gonna send it to yesterday. So I'm gonna kind of start this plan in the middle. Um, I'll go ahead and send it. This takes about 30 seconds or so. I'll go ahead and pause the video real quick. Okay, that actually took about 15 seconds to do, 12 weeks. And so uh, here I am. And you can see that I didn't. it didn't send today's workout. It just started with tomorrow. and. Uh, and it started with this threshold workout. So I could, let's say, move this to here today. So then the next thing you need to do is you need to go to your apps and devices. If you don't have a Training Peaks account already, you should create one. And then come here. You have to connect to Training Peaks and it has you log in and everything. And then once you're connected to Training Peaks, you turn on this sync calendar options. So I go ahead and sync my calendar. And if I go to Training Peaks right now, my calendar is empty, but because I have sync turned on and I have a plan on my calendar here, because there is a plan now, when I refresh Training Peaks, the first week at workouts start showing up in a couple seconds. It only syncs two weeks, this week and next week, for premium Training Peaks users. That allows more custom manipulations of Coach Jack. You can come back and you can go to Chate Coach Jack and you can edit your plan directly in Coach Jack and modify everything rather than having to modify individual workouts. So once I've got it synced to Training Peaks, then I just need to make sure that inside of Zwift, I'm logged into Zwift.com and I go to my, my account there and I come down and I go to Connections. I just make sure that, con that Training Peaks is connected to Zwift. And then when I'm in Zwift, I come here and I go Ride Type and I go to Training. Here we got Training Peaks Custom Workouts. That's all there is to it. And then each day when you show up, you're gonna see your, your Training Peaks Custom Workouts here from Coach Jack. I'm using a Training Peaks Premium account, which makes it show up all two weeks like this. But if you have a free account, it will just show up you know, your workout will show up each day on, the, on this day of the calendar. So you can still use this feature. Thank you very much.